Hey everyone, it's Nick Talk News Sports, and we're back on the video, and today we're talking about my prediction of who will win the Stanley Cup of 2022. So, let's get into it. I will be doing the four teams, two from the Western Conference, two from the Eastern Conference, instead of doing the whole playoff bracket from the first round, semifinal, then the conference, and then the finals. Just conference finals, and then the finals, and then who really wins the Stanley Cup, in my prediction. So just let me know your thoughts about who will win the Stanley Cup. For you, but this is my prediction of who I think will win it. I don't go for teams that are right, the favorite, like this year again, it's the Avalanche. Top four, I think, is the Avalanche, the Lightning, I know the Carolina Hurricanes are in there. Um, so I'm like, you know what, I'm gonna stay away from those. I don't know if that's gonna ever happen, I don't know, because I it just you put the pressure on them and they fail. So, um, yeah, they might have great seasons, but. They might get to the first, second round, third round, or the conference final, I should say, and then not win the Stanley Cup. So, let me get into my um, Western Conference finalist here, or finals, right? Western Conference. Uh, here we go. Starting off from the Western Division, I mean, let's do the Central Division. Here we go. So, it's going to come from the Central Division here, and that's going to be Minnesota. They get to the Western Conference. They've never been this far. The farthest they've been was, um, was it 2014, 2013, something like that, to the second round. They beat the Avalanche in the first round, get to the second round, and they lose against, I forgot who it was. It's the Hawks or something, maybe? Um, but, yeah, they never got past that. And they all saw a team. They got solid defense. Even though losing Suda and Parisi as a forward, uh, we're buying them out. But, you know, they have other guys, solid defense, solid goaltending, solid forwards, right? So I think they can do it. If they get on a little run now, get moving, hey, they can get hot and get to the Western Conference Final. The next team that really gets to me here is the uh, Pacific Division. It could be essential if a wild card team beats a Western team. But, um, I have next. The Vegas Golden Knights. Now, Vegas, um, this should be the third time straight going to the Western Conference Final. And you would hope by now that the Vegas Golden Knights will pull through like they did in 2018. They get to the Finals. Not just get to the Finals, but win the Stanley Cup. Not losing five, but maybe winning five. You know what I mean? So, I have them going to the Conference Final again. It'd be frustrating for them to lose, right? But um, it is what it is, right? So, you'll find out who gets to the finals after we get to the Eastern Conference Final. My prediction, who gets this far. Coming out, to, out of the Atlantic, here we go. I have the Florida Panthers. Now, Florida, they've added... Last year was a surprise season. Really was. You know, they didn't sign... Hoffman and Dad North and guys like that. They changed this team. Bill Zito, first year, did a terrific job. Uh, signed some interesting players, and they turned out really solid, like Carter Heggy. Um, absolutely fantastic. And then, you know, other guys. But, um, you know, this team is, you know, solid. And if they can stay healthy, you know, not lose Ekblad like they did in the season, which was terrific. But, um,. Yeah, but I think the Panthers really do. They added Sam Reinhardt. Solid 50-point guy. Consistent. Uh, exactly what you need is consistency. And I think you found that with him. For sure. Now, um, the other team for the Metropolitan. Here we go. And that's the New York Islanders. Now, New York Islanders, this would be actually the third time. Like the Vegas Golden Knights. <laughs> or the... Wait, this would be the third time? Yeah, just like Vegas. So, you would hope both of these teams would make it to the finals. But the Islanders, I like their defense. Barry Trotz, defensive-minded. And every defensive coach in Lane Lambert. Very good, solid defensive um, shutdown like mentality. You have that, and you have the goalie coach in Mitch Coin. You know, just perfect stuff from the Islanders. And even the forwards, they can score even more now than they did a couple years ago. You know, they have really solid center depth. Um, you know, they have solid goaltending, solid defense. And you can have both of those, but who has better down the middle, right, for the centers? 
and they definitely improved. They have Barzell, Nelson, Pajot, um, Sezikis, great down the middle, absolutely on the wing, solid too. I know they lost Embley, but they can definitely fill in holes there, absolutely, no question about it. Uh, but that team definitely has some great stuff, and hopefully they get back here again. Uh, so, going back to the Western Conference Finals, who wins? Okay, who wins here? Um, you got Minnesota and you got Vegas. Of course, Minnesota and Vegas played last playoffs. Well, the 2021 playoffs, and Vegas won in seven. That was a tough series for Vegas to get out of because, you know, Minnesota played it good. You know, the upper hand, we knew that Vegas should have won, or with the team, the favorites to win, and they did. But it was a tough one in seven, really was. But here, I think who's going to get to the finals. Here we go. I put games in six. So, I have games in six. Minnesota gets to the finals. And it games in six. Actually, let me change that. Let me put it under that one instead. That makes a lot more sense. So you know what I mean. So, yeah. In six. 4-2. Minnesota wins. Shocks them again. Kind of like how Montreal did to Vegas. And Minnesota gets to the finals. I would love that to see that happen. I would absolutely like to see that. All right, moving on now to the Panthers and the Islanders. And this one is going to be an interesting one. Yeah, really two solid teams, but this is what I think. I have 4-3 in Game 7. The Islanders win over the Panthers. And I have the Wild and the Islanders. Who wins this one? Islanders and Wild. Who wins it? And this is what I'm going to tell you. I have... Here we go. Four two Isles win in game six over the Wild, but great to get the Wild this far. Absolutely. Just for the fan base. For the team. Beneficial, absolutely, but disappointing. But the Islanders win. They get the fifth Stanley Cup. And yeah. It's gonna be interesting for sure. So that's what I have. Um in six. Uh definitely interesting. I had the Islanders last year against the Flames. Flames didn't make the playoffs. I thought they're gonna be that Capitals of twenty eighteen. Failing to get to this, you know, some playoff success, and that didn't work out. Hey, it was a good try. But the Islanders got to the conference final again, and everyone's like, oh, maybe the Islanders win. Well, I'm doing it again. Let's see if it does happen. But I have the Wild and the Islanders. I thought about it. I'm like, I can't get my eyes off the Islanders here for losing in the finals and winning the Stanley Cup. So I have the Islanders and the Wild. Just a little surprise that Cinder with. Uh, Cinderella, you know, uh, you know, journey there for the the wild there that I thought would be interesting, like how Montreal had those and how Nashville would have those in 2017 and different ones like that, right? So, thanks for watching. See you next video. Any shocking sports? So let's try to hit 500 subs.